Excuse me LP, do you have a minute for a quick question? Sure Lance. I just have a couple of minutes. I have a conference call at the top of the hour. Okay. I'll make it quick. What do you think of those chemtrails and the chemtrail conspiracy theories? As you know I don't think much of conspiracy theories. They tend to taint the truth with fiction, kind of like the way a drop up his spoils a cup of tea. Gross. Exactly. Here's what I know about so-called chemtrails. On some days, some jets leave trails. On some days these trails are persistent. On some days persistent jet trails dissipate into cloud layers. Cloud layers change the weather. So the easily observable evidence clearly shows that on some days jet trails modify the weather. It's also so so obvious that we must assume that the government knows about it and is either behind it or has approved it. I can also see from the increase in storms and wacky weather that the climate is changing. But I know the weather is changing mostly for other reasons like pollution from human activity and the odd cycle our sun is going through right now. So at the end of the day I don't worry about the jets much. I figure it's probably just the powers that be working hard to extend the current paradigm. And typically when people try to play God it backfires on them. So I simply log the fact that everyone needs to plan to adapt to the weather and that in the future the climate may really change dramatically. So it's another good reason to store shelf stable foods, water, and so on? Yes exactly. But I didn't need the jet trails or conspiracy theorists to tell me that. I just need to look outside the window and make a mental note that the winds are changing. So do you think I should spend time protesting the chemtrails at a rally this weekend? If it makes you feel better about it, sure. You might also consider what other proactive things you can do to build your own resilience for a sustainable future. Is that a hint LP? It's whatever you want it to be. Remember the stories we tell ourselves are just stories that guide us on our path. I think I'll work on my bug out bag and hit the rifle range. I'll see you there. Keep your powder dry Lance. You to LP. Thanks again. See you later Lance.